what's good y'all it's your boy ross back at it again with another video and you guys are awesome bro i reached 10k subscribers man like that is amazing like y'all don't understand like it's different when it comes to the end of clutch page because that's a collective y'all like seeing me and dub interacting you know y'all like our chemistry y'all like our brotherhood on that channel so it makes sense that you know we have a, a decent amount of subscribers there but for y'all to mess with this page mess with my content personally and the things that i like to watch like that is a surprise to me man Ten thousand of y'all chose to rock with me personally that's you don't understand how thankful i am um i've just been in this mode of trying to create and give you guys the best content possible and the amount of love and support i get on this channel from you guys is just amazing i love you guys so much and thank you so much for just allowing me to get to this milestone you feel me um i want to also give a shout out to dub dub is the like one of the biggest reasons if not the main reason I initially started this channel because he he wanted me to do something outside of what we had going for in the clutch and he knows you know my passions and what i'm passionate about and he was the biggest supporter he was the one that told me to start this channel up fun fact i don't know if you guys know i've had this channel since 2008 uh, originally i was just posting like um band videos because i used to be in a band i used to play drums so i was originally just posting band, band videos on this channel and that's all i was doing for years and then afterwards i stopped posting it i wasn't in band anymore and really i was just watching you know different youtube videos and people that i've been subscribed to for years just on on this page i don't know if y'all know uh i am uh i'm dante i've been watching his channel before he hit, he hit a million uh another youtuber i was watching all the time was tyrone magnus uh was watching him before he hit a million too all on this channel just watching some of my favorite youtubers of course hodge twins uh uh what's the other dude name hot damn i rock before it, uh he was posting a lot of videos back in the day in the early youtube days dorntainment these are just some people that i was watching on this very channel but never thought to create my own content i just enjoyed the content that was being created for me you know well not for me but just being created in general so i just find it funny now years later almost 10 plus years later your boy is now active like actively posting on here and creating my own content for you guys and maybe if there's some inspiring youtubers that follow me you know what i'm saying maybe some advice that i give you guys here and some of the stuff that i use you guys could potentially pick up yourself so this is not only going to be a uh a celebration and a thank you to all the subscribers and everyone just being on this journey of me reaching 10k you see it in the title of the video as well this is going to be my new gaming slash recording setup uh, i gotta show this to you guys because this is one of the things that's you know i've been trying to you know I guess you could say make this channel better and the only way i can make this channel even better is to make sure i have the best equipment possible i just finally finished up my setup so i'm about to show you guys that man and uh let's get right into it so guys this is the setup man this is what i've been trying to obtain for really since i started this channel this is kind of how i envision my setup being let's kind of go over some of the things that i've uh, recently purchased all right so right here you see this right here this is actually the game Diaz, uh gaming disc this is the actual like name but they don't show the company is game game Diaz. i got this from micro center for 350 dollars it was on sale i like the disc because it has these these lights on this side and there's some lights on this side that kind of the program i don't know if you can see it 
It's on this side of the, both sides of the disc. I wish it was on the back of the disc, but it's not. There's also, this whole material right here is like a giant mouse pad. It covers the entire length of the disc. So I like that, it's smooth, it's very responsive with the mouse. And cool thing is, right here is where you can honestly like switch on the settings, like the light settings, you can turn it on and off from here, change the colors, all that different stuff. I don't really too much mess with it because it matches what's going on behind my monitor. I also have a light strip set up behind my monitor right here. It has a little rainbow effect going so that they both kind of match. Like I said, I wish they had one at the back of the desk, but they don't. It's cool. Um, I got the, the light strip as well from Micro Center. So, you know what I'm saying? If you got a Micro Center in your city, definitely check them out when it comes to like trying to set up a gaming setup or just a recording setup in general. This chair is an inland gaming chair. Uh, I believe I paid two twenty for this chair it was on sale um definitely worth the purchase like it's very comfortable it's something that i've been needing i know if you guys seen my video i did maybe a couple weeks back of me talking about it this is more of an end-up review uh ever since i've had it these two pillows have been a lifesaver if you've been like if you plan on taking this youtube stuff seriously you're gonna have to, you know, record and edit, and that's gonna take some time, you know, especially if you wanna put out the best content possible. So, you know, you wanna be sitting down somewhere comfortably where you don't have a problem uh, sitting in a chair for a while. You don't wanna have back pain or neck pain, you know. So, this is these right here, and just the overall quality of this chair has been a lifesaver for your boy. Um, also, if you're trying to get into gaming, you're going to be sitting down for a while, you know, if you want to get into the streaming aspect, you want to just have a comfortable chair to sit in. So, you know, you, you're going to want to play the game and stream and create content for your subscribers. All right. Now, right here, if you see this light, I'm not going to stare at it too long, but this is an Elgato key light. It is perfect for streaming for just any youtube type of setup if you're doing reactions if you're doing commentary anything that revolves you being on camera this is the life for you i literally just got this also at micro center micro center has been very crucial to my gaining my whole setup like it's been very crucial to, for me to get the stuff I need to get and since this quarantine stuff has been going on I've just been able to go to the store and pick this up you feel me I don't have to wait I can just go to the store and pick it up this key light also has something dope this Elgato key light it has a dope feature let me show you guys let me show you on my phone this app right here the Elgato uh, uh, control center app for for the device it hooks up to your wireless network and from here if it works from here i can change the brightness of it i can change the the, the color how warm the light is so watch this i'm gonna turn it up tint to it i can also increase the brightness decrease the brightness all through here so it's 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 very helpful for just making sure you have the perfect lighting in in your setup and those who, you know, serious about this YouTube stuff, you may not know this, but lighting is important. You want to have a good lighting for, you know, just in video and photography, lighting is key. So if your lighting is on point, your video will come out looking just a little bit better. So let's get into this right here. This right here is the Audio-Technica ATR2100 USB slash XLR uh, microphone. And uh, I like the fact that I can use this, hook this straight up into my computer, use Adobe Audition. It's a software I use to record myself through through the microphone itself. It's perfect, easy setup, has pretty good quality, you know, it's good at noise canceling. So you're not going to pick up a lot of other background noises. That's why I like using this microphone. And like it says, it's an XLR uh, input. Well, XLR output. So basically, you if you have a mixer and you don't want to use a USB setup, you can just plug it up to a, a, a mixer, and you'll be able to record from there. You know, you, it'll, it has pretty good quality. That's how we record our in the clutch reactions. We hook up this exact mic 
and we hook it up to actually an XLR instead of using Adobe Auditions or another program to the computer. So just giving you guys just some, you know, info or information. I know I've had some people ask me what microphone and what cameras and different equipment that I use. So just kind of giving you guys the stuff that I've been using. You feel me? And of course, I got the Xbox. Uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 4 and then I got Modern Warfare but I actually downloaded that game on the actual from the from the Microsoft store so and I already know that somebody gonna be in the comments oh you you're an Xbox player oh my god I expect better from you Ross what about PlayStation PlayStation where the real men at calm down guys I've had a PlayStation my PlayStation stopped working last year and I ended up getting me this I traded my PlayStation in, got me an Xbox, and it's been cool, man. I enjoy playing Call of Duty. That's primarily the game I play. Uh, I haven't been on Black Ops 4 in a minute. I was actually just playing uh, Warzone with my homie, uh, Dub, who was playing Warzone. So, hey, man, at some point we will be streaming, and I, I already have the setup, you know, ready to go for streaming. So, hey, man, if you guys want to link up with us on Warzone, let us know, man. And, you know. Got my controller, got the headset, you know, nothing too crazy. And this is the setup, bro. I just like the overall aesthetics of my setup. And one of the better features that I like is when I turn off the lights. Boom. This is how it looks at night. It is just a nice atmosphere, bro. All the lights are just, you know, doing their thing. It's bouncing over all the walls. It just looks good. And it's, it's kind of well lit, even though, you know, the light is not on. I can still see things, you feel me? It's, you know, especially if I'm staring at a screen for a while, this is just perfect for my eyes. And just the overall, like, you know, ambience of the whole area over here, I enjoy, bro. So, and there you go. There you have it. That's that's my, my setup, my gaming slash recording setup. Um, I'm just very thankful that I'm in this situation to be doing this. I'm just very thankful to be able to get all these different things so I can bring out the best content possible. You feel me? Um, I use my YouTube money well. I invest in things that will ultimately help me out in the long run. I decided to put my money back into myself. So I got all the things that I needed to get to make this channel the best it could possibly be, man. I'm serious about this YouTube stuff. Um, I'm just very thankful to be in this position. I love you guys so much. Road to, I can't believe I'm about to say this, road to 20K. Comment down below, when did you find my personal channel? I know a lot of people, you know what I'm saying, follow the In The Clutch page, but I wanna know when did you find out that I had a personal channel and when did you guys subscribe, man? I wanna know that, you know what I'm saying? Even if you didn't find me from In The Clutch, let me know when when did you find out about this channel and, and what I bring on this page. And comment down below, man. I want to interact with you guys. I love talking to you guys in the comment sections. The ones that, you know, come at me with some common sense. I appreciate that. I love the back and forth. I love you guys so much. More videos is on the way. I'm about to record some more videos. I'm dropping as many as I can today. At least two more. Like, I'm not playing no games. You feel me? You guys are awesome. I appreciate y'all kicking it with me, and I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.